Breaking news tonight. Immigration marchers on the move in San Francisco during primetime rush hour. We catch up with NBC Bay Area's Tracy Grant on the ground with the very latest. Tracy, what's happening there? Well, I'm hoping you can hear me. It is very loud out here now. You probably heard about the immigration rally that took place in Washington, D.C. over the weekend. Now, this is the Bay Area's contribution to the same cause. Protesters are gathered here in front of Senator Dianne Feinstein's office. She's actually not here. She's in the nation's capital today. But these people say they're hoping she'll still get the message that she needs to do something about what they see as unfair immigration laws. America is a land of um, opportunity. And I wanted to be part of that, and I wanted something good for my children. Bella Camello and her four children came to the United States from India in 1983. She says the process involved three years of paperwork and interviews. Camello says had she waited and tried to immigrate now. I know I don't think I would have made it because now it takes about 10 years, I believe, for someone to sponsor a uh, sibling. At immigration reform events like this small gathering in Oakland today and this 200,000 person march in Washington on Sunday, people have been begging President Obama and other government representatives to finally focus their attention on overhauling the immigration system. They say it's a system that gives many people no choice but to take dangerous risks to enter the United States and live the life of an undocumented worker like these day laborers in San Rafael without benefits or a living wage. We who work for a living simply want to be able to live off our work. You understand? And we don't want to have to die in the fields. That's an old American story that should not be repeated among any ethnicity. Rick Altman of Californians for Population Stabilization wants immigration reform too, but in the other direction. Altman says not only does the government need to start enforcing the immigration laws in this country, but they need to make them stricter. Well, immigration reform is now become a euphemism for amnesty. That is what these people are demonstrating for. They've sneaked into the country illegally. They're working here illegally, which means they've committed fel felonies. Now they want the government to make it all okay and to say that they can stay here with all the benefits of citizens. Now, these protesters are out here. They're screaming, Feinstein escucha, which means Feinstein, listen, listen to them. And as I said, she's not here, but they're hoping that all of this video that you see of this entire group will get back to her. These protesters are saying that now that health care reform is no longer the top issue, it's time to take a look at immigration reform. Live in San Francisco, Tracy Grant, NBC Bay Area News. Thank you, Tracy. And we'll update that situation with Tracy later on this newscast.